Hello and welcome back to Lorefan Gaming Plays Neverwinter Nights Enhanced Edition. I'm your host Lorefan. In today's Neverwinter Nights Enhanced Edition video, we're in Chapter Three still. This time we're in Moonwood, Spy of the World, and we're gonna do a lot more exploring and plus finish some of those henchmen tales and give you all the full uh, dialogues for that. As always, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more Neverwinter Night Enhanced Edition content like this. And do not forget to hit that notification bell so I'll be updated on my Dungeon Dragon videos and more. So you see those people up ahead? Yeah, we're going to attack them. Yeah, the cultists are back. And we're going to have some fun with them. Time to die! I'm going to say this once again. You see, never ever join a call. If you do, you become like those guys, dead. And also, someone like me will take your journal, read it, and then I'm going to read it to everybody else. Still, that's some good information. Looked like the guy was complaining about being stuck here. Well, here's the thing. We're going to explore every bit of this area. Yeah, we're going to do it in today's video. And we're going to meet a new type of foe here. Actually, we met him in the last video, but still, you'll see like this guy up ahead. Welcome to the world of fire giants outside of their lair. Yeah, they are wandering around, guarding the Moonwood spy on the world. So what we're going to do is go ahead and loot everything up. Great news is they are dead. And they're going to be stragglers, so yeah, you heard me right. Stragglers in the video will take care of them too. Also more uh, fire giants, you heard me right. Every single fire giant in this area will uh, die today. Yeah, he was behind, and of course, he paid for it by himself. He should have just died with his buddies, but oh well. You're going to see that bunch in this part of the uh, video today. Yeah, you're going to see them all bunched together. Well, at least unless you see a straggler, but still, most likely, they're all going to be bunched together. So, I'm just going to do some more exploring and killing some more uh, foes. Yeah, that's how I roll, and there is a cave, but first, let's clear everything out. Well, more fire giants are uh, dead. And I'm going to go over here. Okay, what's this debris all about? Nice, I'm getting some nice spells. I might start using them or just save them in case I do need, need them for a uh, lair. I'm going to go explore over here a bit and clear out more uh, foes. And yeah, like those spiders. Well, wow, that is very rare. I have good fortitude saves. Unfortunately, the poison got me big time. Great news is I get to read scrolls. Yes, I love doing that. And voila, 
It's all gone. So let's go over here and do some more uh, damage. It should be an enemy up ahead. Let's kill him. Oh, look at that. That was a lone troll. And he's gone. Okay, we don't need that. I'm not desperate for money, but still, they're good to sell at the beginning. Yeah, well, anything one gold and uh, over is great. Ooh, a lore potion. That is good. really nice. Seriously, that is uh, really nice. I believe this area is clear for now. So what we're going to do is go ahead and go inside that cave. I just uh, pass on by because I want to clear out the area first. Yeah, I always want to clear out the areas first before going inside a new uh, cave. Yeah, I like to cover my tracks. So let me explain on um, what's uh, going on inside this cave besides going for Brody Knox uh, henchman tail chapter item. Now you see the uh, bodies of a uh, fire giant and of course very soon a dragon unfortunately. Yeah, you can barely see it but still something bad happened. Now this spot I just uh, I am at well this is one of the tomes. It's the fifth and uh, final tome you're going to need. Yeah, that's the last one but still let me go back to the story. What happened is the fire giants attacked this uh, poor innocent dragon. It's a good dragon this time. Took its eggs, uh, whoever was uh, alive in the party. Yeah, that was really bad and sad. You'll find out more of that. But still, we're going to loot this rubble. Like I said before, this is a spot you need for a Brody Knox uh, item. Like I said before uh, in my uh, other video for the Henchman Tales, I kept it uh, short, cut everything out. This video, you're going to see everything, the whole dialogue and all. It's like a gift to me, uh, to you all, because I feel like you all should see the uh, dialogue in this game. It is uh, great. I mean, this is like Bioware uh, Prime Time. Yeah, Bioware's uh, Prime uh, Dialogue. I'm going to be honest with you all. It's really great. That's why I like playing these uh, Dungeon & Dragon classics, too. They're well written. Well, actually, most of the Dungeon Dragon games are fun. There's a few of them that are, well, I'm going to say really bad. Yeah. Some I won't even mention. But still, you're basically uh, done once you get the uh, Tome and Brody Knox uh, Henchman Tail items. And all you need to do is just exit there. And then uh, there's another cave up ahead. We'll uh, grab a quest there. But for now, let's uh, be careful on our uh, way out. There's Well, actually, there's nothing here. Let's be honest. Let's just get out of here and uh, go ahead and do more of the uh, Moonwood Spine of the World. Yeah, we'll go ahead and clear more of that out. Yeah, might as well just kill a whole bunch of enemies. Yeah, I always like to clear everything out of an area. So this way there's nothing, I mean nothing going to chase us or anything like that. So we're going to go this way and there's a group of foes we're going to defeat. So let's go ahead and uh, do it. Good news is the front is cleared. We're going to go in this uh, cave. Now there's an NPC we're going to speak with. Like I said earlier, we're going to grab a side quest. Yeah, this side quest you definitely want to grab. You uh, definitely want to grab unless you're like evil or uh, need some evil points. Yeah, then I want to grab it. You just do the evil ones uh, further in the chapter. But we're going to talk to this NPC. For what reason have you violated the sanctity of this cave? Have you come seeking Gorgotha's eggs? You would be wise to answer me, tiny one.
So uh, really uh, quick, while well, I'm going to go show everybody the spot where it is the uh, eggs are at. Now dragons by their uh, color are say more like, I, I think it's like this. Evil dragons are normally uh, base uh, colors like red, black, etc. Now metallic colors such as gold, silver, copper, brass, they're uh, good dragons. And then your neutral dragons are uh, gem colors. Yeah, you heard me right, gem colors. Yeah, including the prismatic dragons. They're uh, neutral. Now this spot I'm pointing at, the uh, dragon egg area. If you go in there and get a dragon's blood, well, the gold dragon will uh, attack you, will jump you. But it's a recipe of the forge items. I'll uh, do that in a future video. So this way you all will uh, benefit from that. Other than that, it is really uh, simple. So what I'm going to do is uh, just go and get out of here. Go ahead and clear out more of Moonwood Spine of the World. Yeah, I'll just clear out more of that area. Because it's really fun to do so and it's worth it. We're uh, outside the uh, Gold Dragon Cave. So next part is we're going to clear out rest of this uh, area here. Yeah, rest of the Spine of the World will uh, definitely clear out. I decided to buff my uh, character up with a Bless Potion. Yeah, me and Linlu just going to kick some serious uh, butt. So let's go ahead and uh, trash the foes together. Fight! Good news is, more bad guys are dead. Yeah, they are. Seriously, they are. Oh, wow. That is nice. That's a good halt. If I use harps, but I really don't. I used more of the fire aspects. Still, I use the uh, songs to buff up. They're really nice. That was another uh, bad guy dead. Yeah, he's gone. He's toast. He's big time uh, dead. Let's go ahead and check for more treasure. You may never know. You might find a nice plus weapon. You might find a lot of gold or I am that's really worth a lot of gold to sell. Still, we're going to keep on going. Keep on moving. We're going to check this uh, part out. That is it for the combat portion of this video. Now, besides I'm looting everything up like crazy, the next part of the video I am going to do is the Henchman Tales. Reason being is it's the last time, and I promise uh, people who watch my Henchman uh, video guide on this uh, chapter, I'll give them the full dialogue for this Let's Play video. Yeah, that's a gift from me. So what I'm going to do is teleport back into town, so let's go ahead and do it. I am back at the uh, temple now. Yeah, 
um, back here. So you definitely want to do is once you grab the last henchman tail items, you want to do is just simply turn them all in. Yeah, turn them all in at once. Why? Well, here's the thing. You don't want to miss out on anything. As soon as you turn in the last words of power, that's it. You're in the chapter four. So I'm going to do is I'm going to turn every single one of them in. Hey there, dear. What can I do? I have been waiting for you. I suspected you would return. Do you need me to join with you once more? Is there something you need? Is there something you need? You're back. So you Is there something you need? That is one down. Good thing I didn't turn them away. Extra experience is always good. So I'm going to turn in the rest of them. Is there something you... It is certain as death itself. You're back. So you must need something. The most logical assumption is that you want me to join up with you again. Correct? Is there something you need? Is there something you need? Yeah. 
Is there something you need? Is there something you need? I have been waiting for you. I suspected you would return. Do you need me to join with you once more? Yes? Is there something you need? 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 I figured they'd drag your carcass back here eventually. You need me to come with you again? Eh? Eh? What can Tommy do for you?
can Tommy do for you? What can Tommy do for you? I suspected you'd show up here soon. I'm glad to see I was right. So, shall we join up once more? Yes? Is there something you need? Yes? Is there something you need? Yes? Is there something you need?
Yes? Is there something you need? I hoped that you would return, so I waited here. Hey there, dear. What can I do for you? Hey there, dear. What can I do for you? That is it for all the henchmen tales. All the side quests for them are officially done and over with because the good news is there are none for chapter 4. That was more of an action packed chapter. More on that chapter when we get to it. So what I'm doing is while I'm uh, going back to the spy in the world, I'm going to give everybody a nice review for today's video. First of all, we explored spy in the world, met some fire giants, we killed them. Then unfortunately when this one dragon's cave saw the carnage there. We went in the gold dragon cave, got ourselves a side quest, and finally cleared out the rest of the spine world afterwards to arrive at the entrance of the fire giant. Afterwards, we teleport back into town and turn it on the henchman tales. Well, this is it for my Neverwinter Nights Enhanced Edition Chapter 3 Moonwood Spine of the World video. This is Lord Fent signing off. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day or night. Please stay safe. Please subscribe to my channel for more content like this and do not forget to hit that notification bell to be updated on my videos and more. If you like more videos like I suggested, check out the one on the upper left and on the bottom left if you like YouTube suggestion of my videos.